video taken from the Israeli television. Pope Francis has just arrived at the home of President Shimon Peres of Israel, who was also with him earlier this morning at the um, Yad Vashem Holocaust Memorial. The Pope, of course, yesterday in Bethlehem asked Israeli President Perez and Mahmoud Abbas of the State of Palestine to come to Rome to, as he said, to my home in the Vatican, to pray for peace. Both presidents have accepted. The visit is expected to take place sometime in June or July. July is often the holiday month for the Pope in the sense of not having appointments, but this is too important. So he's being introduced. Well, hello. <laughs> so we're at the residence. I have been to this residence before. It has lovely gardens, quite a number of public rooms for events such as this, and then obviously the private living quarters of the president. It appears that the Pope now is being asked to sign a a guest book. And also on television you see in a split screen a rabbi talking about the visit this morning to the Wailing Wall, the Western Wall, the Western Wall actually of the original temple, and about the visit to the chief rabbis and also about the visit to the Yad Vashem Holocaust Memorial. I do not have the volume of the television on because, of course, it's in Hebrew, and none of us would understand that. <laughs> I wonder if we will learn what the Holy Father has written in this book. He so desperately wants peace. He has seen both sides of the coin here. He's been to the state of Palestine. He was there yesterday, as you know. And he's now in the state of Israel. All of the visits, most of the visits, revolving today around meetings with Israelis. Israelis. But yesterday, of course, the high point was meeting with Patriarch Bartholomew. And he will meet with the Patriarch again today. There will be Mass in the Senegal in the upper room. Well, that is all for just the moment. If we have more later about the speeches, I will get those to you.